Hey guys, Mrs. Cam's here. Uh, welcome and welcome back to the channel. I am still in my little onesie here. Um, don't really have anywhere to go today because we are stuck at home. Um, so my county or my city, we are sheltering in place. So we're not really allowed to go anywhere unless we're going out for essential items. So I don't feel the need to dress up. So I just pretty much wear my pajamas all day. Anyway, um, just checking in with everyone. I hope everyone's staying safe, um, following the rules, social distancing. Um, this is all just to keep everyone as safe as possible. It has been a struggle, not gonna lie. You know, um, everyone is at home now. Um, my oldest daughter, she's home from, from college. And then my youngest daughter, she has not been in school for about, this is her third week out of school. Today, we officially started homeschooling. So today's our first day. It's been tough. It was a lot of work. I didn't think it was going to be that much work. And basically, it's just like, watch this video, answer these questions. I mean, I feel like they could have been a little bit more interactions with the teachers, um, maybe some virtual classroom type learning. But this is more like, watch this video from YouTube or something and then do the work. So we'll see how that goes. It's our first day, so maybe things will get better. Here's my oldest daughter, she's home. I think for her, I think she also starts um, online today as well. And her school, I mean, they're just, they're done for the year. Basically it's online, there's no going back. So she'll be home for the rest of the year. Yeah, she's not happy about it either. No, I'm not happy about it because she has an apartment where her school is and I'm still paying for her rent but she refuses to go back home. So I'm paying rent for her apartment and then she's here. So that's the issue I have with that. But anyway, I'm, I'm glad that she's here. I mean, I always enjoy having her here. Anyway, so that's what I've been dealing with. My husband's also working from home. So everyone's at home and I'm not used to that. I'm used to being at home. I work from home, so I'm home. Nothing's changed for me really, but it's really weird having everyone else at home with me too. So takes some getting used to. Anyway, so like I said, we don't really have much going on today. We are just at home. And I'm trying to set the camera up here so I can talk to you guys. Yeah, so hold on. Yeah, so we don't have much going on today. We'll just be at home. I think later I do have to go to Walmart because I have to get like some notebooks and some Sharpies and some markers and stuff for my younger daughter because we don't really have um, very many supplies here for her for school. So I think we'll have to go out for that a little bit later. Other than that, we're just at home. We're homeschooling and I've been doing projects. Cleaned out my pantry. I did some stuff to my backyard. I planted some flowers. We did have a couple days of like really nice weather, but now it's kind of bad. But yeah, this is outside. So I planted those flowers. That was one of the my projects that I did. Let me show you my younger daughter. She's actually doing her schoolwork right now. Let's see. I don't want to annoy her and bother her because she's like really focused. Say hi. Say hi, Ashton. That's my doggy. Yeah, so I hope everyone's been taking care of themselves. I know like for a lot of people being at home, um, could be depressing and sad and you know um, can actually cause some mental health issues So yeah, just make sure you're taking care of yourself and that you're getting out um, At least once or twice a day to get some Physical activity in, get some sunshine vitamin D is very important. So make sure you guys are going out there um, To walk and when you're out walking just try and stay six feet away from the whoever's in front of you. In our neighborhood, there are lots of people out walking, um, just trying to get some physical activity in. I know for me, oh my gosh. So we have been under a shelter in place order for over two weeks now. I think this may be going into our third week. I'm not sure. My days are just all running together. But I can tell you 
the past two weeks, I have gained five pounds. And look at, see, you can see it in my face, like, mm, there's definitely no, it's just chubby. So yeah, I've gained about five pounds and I told myself today, okay, look, I have to stop. So the snacking, you know, stuff like that, I'm gonna do a lot better. So today I told myself I was gonna cut out sugar. That's been the biggest trigger for me in the past two weeks. I have just been consuming a lot of sweets um, I am addicted to sugar, I am aware. So I am definitely working on that right now. Like the more I eat sugar, the more I crave sugar. So I'm gonna like really focus this next week um, eliminating if I can, but at least minimizing my sugar intake because um, guys, they have extended this whole shelter in place for another 30 days and I just can't sit at home and just eat junk like this. I mean, we bought all these snacks for the kids and I have been eating all the snacks. So yeah, I'm definitely going to do a lot better this week. And just everyone make sure you guys are taking your vitamins. I have um, a couple vitamins that I take daily to help keep my immune system up. I think I might do a video on like what I'm taking, um, just what I'm taking like right now, just to help with my immune system. There are some different things that I've added that I, I did a previous video about vitamins, but I have some new things that I take now that I've been um, taking just here recently since this whole virus thing has been going around. And I also have some things that my kids take as well. But one thing that I do take every day now is uh, vitamin C. I just drink emergency and they have the immune plus, I think it says, that has some added things, but I take vitamin C every day. So just make sure you're keeping up your vitamin C. Now, I don't know if this really works or not, but I do. I always hear people say that, so I've been taking that every day. Anyway, I will check back in a little bit later, but I just wanna say hi to everyone. Um, I'm still here. I'm just adjusting to this whole new home life that I have. You know, so I will try to put more videos out. But in the meantime, I just want to say hi and everyone stay safe. And remember, don't go out unless you just really have to go out and just stay safe, everyone. Bye.